may be able to tell these around the world. So I am a witch and a tarot reader, and also take whatever resonates and leave what doesn't do. For this is a genderless reading, and we are now going to be going for the signs of Aries. And I will get straight into the reading. I will also be doing your charms, divination dices, and your tarot messages at the end. So let's get started. I'm also doing personal readings, so book a reading with me on Etsy, Instagram, or email. Dear Aries, I wanted to contact you and tell you how I truly feel, but there is no one like you. I used to have options left and right and trying to make clear decision on what I want and who I wanted, and that answer has been clear. For who I wanted is you. You're not like most girls or guys who I have had dated in the past. And you're truly got a lot going within your life. Like really going on within your life. I just don't want to disturb someone as amazing and wonderful and talented and gorgeous such as yourself. I have really felt guilt like no other for hiding myself from you and not really telling you how I truly feel. I am trying to do things on my own terms because I am not fully ready to invest in you just yet. Please be patient, for I am trying to come forward with an offer that I hope you don't refuse. I know I may not or may have come aloft or not really shown you any forward intentions or movement, and I will respect it if you feel like running away from me. I will do my best to listen to what you have to say and what you want to say, for in truth, I am deeply and helplessly in, in love with you, and I am scared on what these feelings are towards you, Aries, for you are my one true happiness and love, and I'm sorry if I try to take control of the situation, though. I may have heard of you in the past, and I'm sorry, truly. That is what I have. I'm going to roll your divination dices. I'm doing this twice. There's four dices here. Two Pisces, Virgo, and Gemini. Pisces, Aries, Cancer, and Aquariuses. This also initials and other zodiac signs as well. So I got the signs of Pisces, twice Libra, Sagittarius, Capricorn, twice Capricorn, Cancerian, and Aquarius. And also I got Aries and twice the Pisces. So the initials I have are N, I think this is a G. Yeah, that's a G. R F B N W K A J and E. I got the names J. Jake. Also, this could be like new love here. I also got Dre. Fay. Ooh, fairy. Nick, Neat, Dan. Ooh, I got Ran, Rain, Jar. They probably live at a distance with you, but I got far, and they think of you as someone who is very fair. It's 
what I have though. Make your charms next. So cute. Wanting to open up one's heart. Yeah, a little more. Someone truly loves you. And a grandmother and a granddaughter's love is forever. Live in the moment. Wanting you to travel on vacation though. There's a lot of magical and mystical moments as well. And really setting sail on a new adventure. Where there is a heart. There is so much love and opening one's heart though. They're so deeply in love with you, though. Your strength is beautiful, though. They love you to the moon and back. And they say, I feel about you. Makes my heart long to be free. They're in love with you. And they really are trying to break free from any attachments that they may have had. In the past, though. Young, strong, and beautiful. What's for you will not pass. Ooh, that's a sign saying, if you feel like something's not for you, then it will not be for you. But if you feel like something is for you, then it will not leave you. I'm gonna get 10 messages now. Let's get started. Nine of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. The Lovers. And the Magician. Ooh, the empress in the back of this deck. Someone who's very nurturing and kind, but someone who's beautiful. And even it's also divine feminine energy as well. So you could be really manifesting something. Or they could be manifesting you. It could be either or though. But someone who really wants to come back. They're going to really try to invest in this energy though with you, wanting to make sure that you really know that you have a lot of worth within it and they see your value, they see your true beauty and how understanding and kind you truly are within yourself. They know that you're living the moment, they know that you really are standing your ground to have this independence and they really are practicing and wanting to communicate with you on how they truly feel. They're so deeply in love with you. They're not quite sure on where it is that they're supposed to go with it. But they truly feel on what they feel from the heart space. And also you're on their mind very deeply and heavy. They want to be patient with what they are going to be giving you. It may look small, but it actually is much more bigger than what it is and they really are trying to practice on what they want to say towards you but that's all they have for you guys though i hope you guys have a lovely and amazing day also like comment subscribe down below though and may peace and everything be amongst you bye my beautiful aries though peace though